Samsung is ready to roll out its newest One UI 7 update, which is based on Android 15, to a number of Galaxy devices. This update is anticipated to add new features, improve performance, and optimize the user experience for Samsung smartphones and tablets. The rollout will begin immediately after the Samsung Developer Conference on October 3rd, with the stable version of One UI 7 expected to reach devices soon after. Samsung often uses a phased approach for big upgrades, and One UI 7 will be no exception. As the most recent flagship update, the Galaxy S24 series will be the first to receive the One UI 7 update. These devices are expected to showcase the update's finest features and enhancements. Z Fold 6 and Galaxy Z Flip 6 Samsung's newest foldable phones will also be among the first to receive the Lu update, which includes new capabilities particularly designed for foldable screens. The Galaxy S23, S22, and S21 series, which were formerly flagship models, will be the next to get the update, which is due in November. Owners should expect improved performance design and overall usefulness. Around the same time, Samsung's earlier foldable models, the Galaxy Z Flip 3, Flip 4, and Flip 5, will also receive an update to UI 7. These foldable devices will also receive the One UI 7 update in addition to the Flip series. Galaxy S23 Fan Edition and S21 Fan Edition, the Fan Edition models of the Galaxy S23 and S21 will also get an update in November, delivering many of the same enhancements as their flagship counterparts. Galaxy S Series Samsung's popular mid-range Galaxy S Series will begin getting One UI 7 in late November, including ring enhancements for models like as the Galaxy A54, 34, 24, 14, and others that bring them closer to Samsung's flagship offerings. Samsung's tablets, including the Galaxy Tab 9, Tab S9, and other models, will receive an update to UI 7 before the end of the year. The update will improve the tablet experience, notably in areas such as multitasking and productivity. The One UI 7 update will follow this strategy, with the company aiming to update most eligible devices by the end of the year, however, actual release dates may vary depending on region and carrier. Samsung has a strong track record of delivering timely updates to its devices, particularly its flagship models. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So with that been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.